Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can use the commands in the editing group on the home tab in the ribbon to execute several commands that can assist you in editing Word documents. You can use the functions in this section to quickly find and replace document content. This can be extremely useful for quickly revising standard documents that need minor repetitive changes to the text. To perform a basic search for text in your document, you can click the Find button to open the navigation pane at the left side of the document window and display the search document search box at the top of the window. You can then type the word or phrase for which you want to search within your document into the search box. Word will automatically find and highlight the text that you enter within the document and also display the matching result locations within the results pane below the search box. You can click on any result shown in the pane to jump to that selected section of the document. When you're finished, you can click the small X button at the right end of the search box to clear your search results. You can also search for text within your document and then replace the text with another text entry of your choosing. To do this, click the Replace button within the Editing group on the Home tab in the ribbon. Doing this will open the Find and Replace dialog box and display the Replace tab. This tab allows you to replace the text that you find with other text that you enter. To use this feature, enter the text that you want to find into the Find What text box. Then enter the text that you want to replace the found text with into the Replace With text box. You can then click the Find Next button to find the next occurrence of the text within the document. The text will be selected. You can then click the Replace button to replace that with the text that you entered. You can then continue to click the Find Next button and the Replace button to move through the document replacing the text, or you could also simply click the Replace All button to replace all instances of the found text with the replacement text that you entered throughout the document all at once if desired. Now if you would like to perform an advanced find of information within your document, note that you can also click the Find tab within the Find and Replace dialog box. You could also access this tab by clicking the drop-down arrow that appears to the right of the Find button within the Editing group on the Home tab in the ribbon, and then choosing the Advanced Find command from the Buttons drop-down menu. Now on this tab, you can enter the text for which you would like to search into the Find What text box. You can then click the Find Next button to find the next occurrence of the selected text within the document. Also note that if you need more specialized options for either the Find or Replace tabs, you can also click the More button at the bottom of either tab to display more advanced search options at the bottom of the dialog box. You can check any of the options shown by the checkboxes in the Search Options section to enable or disable those parameters when performing your search. The last tab in the Find and Replace dialog box is the Go To tab. You could also access this tab by clicking the drop-down arrow that appears to the right of the Find button and then selecting the Go To command from the button's drop-down. Now you can use this tab to quickly move through the document. In the Go To What list, you select the object by which you want to move through the document. You then enter a search reference to the object to which you wish to move in the adjacent field. The specific directions for each selected object from the Go To What list 
are shown next to the text box to assist you. You can then click the Go To button to browse through the document by the selected object using the increments that you entered. For some of the selections, you can also use the Previous and Next buttons to browse through the document by the selected object using increments that are entered. When you're finished, just click the Close button to close the Find and Replace dialog box. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.